fresh na mga bagong Tayo no kami O nga no, ginaya mo pa yung damit Michelle, who are you wearing today? Styled by curator. Wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. How was the preparation for Miss Universe? Very good. I have an amazing team behind me. I know that they'll give me the necessary tools to excel in El Salvador. When are you leaving now for El Salvador? End of October. Wow. Out of 100%, how prepared are you? 200%. Wow. <laughs> Thanks, course. Michelle. Thank you so much. Hi, Michelle. Hello. Congratulations. What for you? makes a woman of style and substance? Well, I'm, I'm, first of all, thank you so much, people of Asia, for giving me this recognition. You know, I really believe it's an accumulation of all of my... It's an accumulation of all of the efforts. You know, all of my life, I've just wanted to create a platform, to create positive change, and to be able to get this recognition is um, an amazing feeling because it gives me a sense of validation and that all of the hard work that I'm putting is being put to good use, of course. Congratulations. to be here tonight in such fabulous company. First, congratulations to the incredible group of inspiring women who are being recognized tonight. It is truly an honor to be one among you. And of course, thank you also so much to Joanne Ramirez, Paolo de la Cruz, Ambassador Ben Romaldez, and the entire People Asia team for your commitment to celebrating women's stories. And I have to give a special shout out to the photographers and also to people who do the photoshopping. So thank you very much for that. So. Uh, when I received my 10th edition of the issue, I, the very first thing I did was send it off to my mom in Little Rock, Arkansas. I consider her to be my first and still most important role model. When my siblings and I were all in high school, she went back to her own graduate school to get a master's degree. And she called me the moment that she got the magazine and told me how much she loved seeing all the pictures and reading the stories about the inspiring women contained in the magazine. Today, the people who most inspire me are both young women and men. I look to the women of my daughter's age, my daughter's generation, 20-year-olds, 25, 30-year-olds, and their male allies who are addressing unconscious bias bolstering opportunities for each other and not accepting anything less than full equality. Because of this, I am hopeful for future generations. It's a great time to be a woman. Thank you again for this very meaningful award. Thank you again for the Ambassador for Sports. The LGBTQIA plus community also uses her voice to actively raise awareness as an ambassador of the Autism Society of the Philippines. Mga kaibiga, please welcome our Miss Universe Philippines 2023, the gorgeous Miss Michelle Marquez 
B. Well, ladies and gentlemen, to our esteemed judges, I mean guests, wala pa ng judges here, and of course, to all of the awardees, good evening. I really want to show my deepest gratitude for this Women in Style of Substance Award. This recognition is not just a testament to my journey, but it's also a reflection of the grace, the resilience, and the fighting spirit that every woman has to make their unique mark in this world. In a few weeks, humbly, I'm about to embark on a new journey at both representing our beloved country, the Philippines, at the 72nd Miss Universe in El Salvador. And when I go there, thank you so much. And when I go there, I am not just carrying myself, but I'm carrying the hopes, the dreams, and the vibrant spirit of every Filipino. Collectively, I know that we can create a positive change around the world and make a great impact on the global stage with an emphasis to creating a more inclusive world and as well as to my lifelong mission and the cause closest to my heart, which is towards autism acceptance, awareness, and inclusivity. Together, we are all women of style, absolute style but we are also women with the greatest substance. Fortified by our diverse backgrounds, and may we continue to pave the way, illuminate the paths, break barriers, and continue to, to build bridges for everybody. Once again, thank you, thank you so much, especially to the people that have put me where I am right now, my core team, of course, Miss Universe Philippines, my business partners as well. And of course, People Asia, thank you so much for this recognition. It means so much to me. And maraming maraming salamat. That was a speech worthy of a 72nd Miss Universe. One more round of applause, please. Miss Michelle. King's College and Master's Degree in Clinical Dermatology from the St. John's Institute of Dermatology in London. Our next award is established clinics that offer holistic premium skin, body, and wellness solutions tailored to fit all of her patients' needs. Firmly believing that beauty is much, much more than what meets the eye, she makes sure that her clients feel beautiful both inside and out. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our next awardee, the founder.